Hi, I'm walking my way through a free tutorial out there on the internet uh, called Soft Tutor AutoCAD 2D and 3D. It's a light version of the full product, but it's a really fun way to learn AutoCAD. If you don't have AutoCAD, you can get a free copy at Autodesk.com. And uh, you can see here, here's the uh, free trial. Basically, you just click on, um, we'll go back to the home page, click on AutoCAD. Click on this icon over here. Click on uh, free trial and uh, download a free trial. Free trial will give you AutoCAD for 30 days so you can uh, play around with it. Anyways, uh, with this Soft Tutor tutorial, uh, what you want to do is just choose the lesson that you want. I've been working my way through it. Now I'm doing uh, solids. So basically, you uh, start Soft Tutor and then you pause it, and then you open up the corresponding example file. So it's 9.1. So then I go into AutoCAD, and click on the A icon, go to Open, Drawing. I learned how to do all of this with the Soft Tutor demo. So I just choose uh, 9.1, choose Open. Uh, the Soft Tutor orientation video will teach you how to work, how it works with AutoCAD, but it's real cool thing. Anyways, let's play it and we'll watch what the instructor does. I've actually played this once before, so I'm a little bit good at it. But, uh, and if you don't have your user interface set up the same, you'll, you know, watch the video that shows you how to set up the user interfaces up. I'm pretty far along in this, so I'm gonna just open it up. I'll make it pretty big because he doesn't talk about anything down here. He pretty much just talks about stuff down there. <coughs> So now we'll just play it. On the screen here are a series of profiles and their paths. And we're going to take this, each one of these through a sweep command and show you different possibilities. Right down the left hand corner down here is something that has a more interesting cross section. It looks like a circular cross section with two chunks taken out of it. What I want to do is take this along this path using the sweep command. So let's try the sweep command right here. Select it, pick the profile, hit the down arrow choose the mode, and that's a solid. And down in my command window, I have some subcommands. I'm going to choose a key in T for twist, and I'm going to put a 180 degree angle on that. Now I'm going to select the path. And when I do, I get something that looks like a drill bit. Okay, let's move down the line. And this time what I want to do is take this along this arc, but watch what happens when I use the sweep command. This time, I'm going to select the object, down arrow for mode. Again, I want a solid mode. Just make sure we have that. And again, in my command, I have I have a, an option for scale. And I'm going to key in 0.25 for the scale factor. And watch what happens now when I pick the path. I get something that looks like this. So at the end, it winds up to be a transitional solid from 1 to 0.25. So you can see how this goes. <clears throat> You'll also learn how to draw a profile. So what <clears throat> we can do is I can go back here to this one that I just drew. And uh, I can undo that. And then I can draw my own profile actually by just choosing a, let's say we want to draw a box here. We'll just draw a box. Okay. And then I can watch the video again if I forgot how to do it. In my command I have I have a, an option for scale. Let's rewind it just a little bit more. And this time what I want to do is take this along this arc. But I'm going to take the one that I just I did. Sweep command. <clears throat> this time I'm going to select the object, down arrow for mode. Again, I want a solid mode. Just make sure we have that. And again, in my command, I have I have a, an option for scale. And I want to key in 0.25 for the scale factor. And watch what happens now when I... I'll do a 0.23. I get something that looks like this. So at the end, it winds up to be transitional. <laughs> so see, once you learn the fundamentals, you can basically apply it to anything that you want. You draw your own shapes. Basically, it walks you through how to twist things, how to take flat profiles, how to take take scales. So one of the things he didn't do, and it takes a little bit of time for you to watch this, is uh, he said scale. Uh, he typed it an S, but he didn't say that he typed it an S. So. You have to watch it a couple of times. If you get confused, you know, play it full screen. There is a way to slow the video down, too. It's uh, in the README file. But basically, play it full screen. Watch what he's doing 
then you can shrink it down, you know, and, and follow along with it after a while. But uh, I've been working on this for maybe uh, five, six minutes, and uh, I've already learned how to do all these. Uh, don't save the example file, so you can always come back and play with it again. Uh, SoftTutor is a great tool. I think uh, about 250,000 people use it. Uh, they've been around for a really long time. So I didn't save the example file. Now I can open it up and try it again. Uh, you learn a lot. Download the free trial. Play around with it. See what you like. If you like it, buy the full version. If not, at least you got a great free product that you can do some fundamental things with an AutoCAD.